My name is Vladimir Hassan. I'm the head coach at Hawken. Uh, we just played our last CBC game against West G. Difficult team. Um, we scored a goal maybe five minutes left in the first half and then we scored very early in the second half. Mm -hmm. uh, after that we didn't have the best of performance after we went up to nothing but uh, having though that two goal advantage maybe made our team step back a little bit and try to protect the lead and it's normal it's normal we um, we had a two nothing lead at Orange and with seven minutes left they scored the first goal and then they equalized with 25 seconds left. So I know my players and me have had that experience in the back of our mind. Uh, they got a PK at the end and made a score 2-1. But I felt we were in control of the game in the second half, even though we did not play our best game. Uh, we could have created more going forward, but the other team did not create too much either, so when you have a two-goal advantage, it's important for the other team to, to not create and not get on the score sheet because you can control the game to the end and, and get the, the W. Mm -hmm. What, what uh, are you looking forward to as you head towards the uh, OHSA tournament? Uh, I think this was our eighth game of the season, so it's half of the season is gone. Uh, we played some pretty tough teams in these first eight games of the season, like West G, Chagrin, CVCA, University School. Um, so we are now three, two, and three. Uh, we're gonna try to keep on going and and use this momentum. Try to play a little bit more. Try to find the best way that our team can move forward because. Playing against some better teams than you, you have to to sacrifice your team a little bit and make them play in a way where you limit the strengths of the opponent. Uh, so we're gonna need to to continue going and having more and more games under our belt will help us our fitness, our sharpness, and hopefully we can get on a good run before the playoffs and and try to go as far as we can because. We believe and anything is possible in high school soccer. Sure. Anybody can beat anybody <laughs> on any given day. Who do you got uh, coming up uh, later this week? We have a very difficult game against the D1 team, Toledo St. John's. So we have a, a long trip to Toledo. They will not be easy sure. and a tough game there. Um, and after that, next week we have a game Monday against Gilmore. Then we play Beachwood on Thursday. Benedictine on Saturday, then Illyria on Monday. So from this Saturday to the next Monday, I believe we have four games in nine days. So <laughs> that's going to test our team and, and every member of our team. So it's not going to be easy. Great. Congrats, coach. Thanks yeah, so much.